What is up everybody? I'm back again. This time I'm at the train crossing off of 3rd Street in Effingham, Illinois. And we're going to do a tour of this crossing. And I'd like to see likes on these videos as I plan out in the other crossing tour off the crossing of Willow Street here in Effingham, Illinois. Um, like I said earlier, the train crossing down yonder, way over there, has Western and Colin Hayes LED lights. I don't know if they're first or second generation, though. Um, that one, I don't know. This one here, and the gate back over there is Safe Tran, and the gate the signal base is Safe Tran as well. This one here. And that crossing over there, the e-bell's in a weird spot. It's actually mounted behind the light on that other signal over there. And usually they're on top, just like this one. And I don't know if that this is a safe train e-bell, just by looking at it, or a general signals. But, uh... I'm going to go down that way once these guys go by. At first, we're going to show you the lights and then that electronic bell. Okay. Right there, you got the uh, emergency contact information there. Safe train. Gate Mac, signal base, safe hand lights, and there is the electronic bell up there. Don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a safe train or a general signal. So that, you guys would have to post a comment in the section down below if you guys would. Help me out with that. Now the, the electronic bell in Altamont off the crossing of 3rd Street, that's a type 2 safe train. That much I do know. Lights are safe train. And then at the very top of the Gantelier in Aldemont, um, the there's a US and S teardrop mechanical bell. It's either been disconnected or it's dead. That one I am very unsure of. So we're that thing's been unhooked for a long time. And back to this one here. There's that electronic bell on that crossing over there. Western Colin Hayes lights. I do believe those are 12 by 24 inch. And what doesn't make sense, all these lights here are Western Colin Hayes on this crossing, and those are safe train. So is CSX using the Western Colin Hayes lights now? And there's that electronic bell. And again, as I pointed out, I don't know if that's a safe train or general signals. And this signal here, of course, it's the Western Colin Hayes lights. Not the Western Colin Hayes, listen to me. Safe train, excuse me, 12 by 24 inch. Not Western Colin Hayes, it's safe train. Safe train gate Mac and signal base. Which is all, that's all it is in town, really. So, with that being said, guys, have a great rest of your afternoon. I'm your host, Captain Amco. If you guys really enjoyed my crossing tour videos, I will be posting more of those whenever it gets warmer. So when it gets warmer back at my house, I'll give you guys a tour of the crossing off of Fayette County Road 5 which will take you into a small community known as St. James. And I will tell you, the lights are Western Colin Hayes, LED lights, signal base gate, Mac, electronic bells, all Western Colin Hayes. Um, so, if you guys have not seen any of my train videos out by where I live at, 
And those of you guys who have, well, you guys know LED Western Helen Hayes lights. Um, electronic bell, signal based, skate mat, whatever. So with that being said, we're heading back to my Uncle Doug's. Probably gonna get my butt chewing, but I've been gone all morning. I went to go see my friend's graveside, so I did take some extra time to myself to kind of, you know, regather, regather my bearings, as I like to say. Um, but I'll go into detail on that one on a live stream sometime. So, you guys remember the LED safe tran lights over there off the Fourth Street. I just showed you that earlier this morning. And sometime or another, I'll have to do a uh, train video. It's a crossing off of Willow Street when I'm in Effingham next. Because then you guys will get to see how much brighter the LED lights are on the safe train, on the uh, Western Colin Hayes lights in Effingham compared to what they are out by where I'm at. So I'm, I'm thinking the second generation LED lights are a little bit brighter than the first gen. So but then again, I don't know. So that being said, everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed my train crossing tour videos. I will be posting the train video that I filmed today at my local Gopher's Grill when I get home. Um, I'll also be posting the train crossing touring videos. So you guys got some train crossing touring videos. So I shot a few uh, touring videos, which is all right. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like down below. Hit that like button. Leave a comment down below if you want. Make a good comment. Um, I will warn you that my comments will have to be approved. I have to review them. I have my account set to where I have to view my comments and then approve them if I decide, okay, yeah, I want this kind of comment on my video. And the reason why that is, I had some bad, nasty comments right after I'd say a few months after I got on my got my YouTube going actually. I you know I set my thing where I have to approve the comments. And ever since then my channel's been going smoothly. So with that being said, it's nothing against you guys. I'm just doing it to prevent any kind of inappropriate comments. So that way if Anything is probably marked as spam. I'll get notified on my channel about it and I'll have to go take a look. So on and so forth. Sometime I'll do another train crossing video tour. Uh, the next crossing I'll do a tour of will be the one off Banker Street, which I will be doing that probably over the summer when I'm in town, if we come down much. Um, Let's see, I'll be tour doing touring cross uh, crossing tour videos over by Casey's and over by IDOT, Illinois Department of Transportation. And I'll even do our tour vi touring video of the train crossing over by my local IGA store. So, with that being said, everybody, I hope everybody has a great day. And I hope everybody has a Merry Christmas if I'm not if I don't, you know, shoot a live video by then. With that being said, everybody, may your journeys to the claw machine be a success. Uh, your train videos, whatever you guys film. And good luck on all them cold start videos out there, everybody. Thanks for watching.